adult cardiac surgery and has a master's degree in cardiovascular science and uh, she's uh, looking to improve quality and safety of the cardiac theater whilst reducing the cost of the NHS. Welcome. Thank you very much. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you again uh, for giving me the opportunity to present our study. So we all know that um, <coughs> NHS is in unprecedented financial strain at this moment and uh, we have to save up to 20 billion pounds for next uh, five years. Uh, how can we do it? We can do it by working um, um, effectively, and um, they mostly, or mostly, most of them can be done by working smarter and removing our waste. Uh, Lord Carter said that um, the, the recent advance in medicine has put a pressure in our NHS, so we have to work um, and look through properly how NHS uh, precious resources can be used as effectively as possible. So the most important uh, cost in cardiac surgery we can found in cardiac theater. So we look through the quantify uh, wastage of resources and time in cardiac surgery theater. At first we um, explored the redundancy in surgical tray. Uh, over, uh, over a period of four months, we have uh, looked at the uh, usage use of uh, instrument in elective coronary artery bypass graft tray. And that was uh, initiated with one consultant and four uh, cases, and followed by four other consultants and four cases each. This uh, slide uh, very um, uh, nicely demonstrates the uh, two uh, tray. The left sided tray shows the tray with all instruments, uh, and uh, the right sided tray showing the instruments which are unused. So, um, uh, many content of the tray are uh, amal historical amal amalgamation of instrument, which has been uh, amal uh, 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 added uh, because two uh, units in Leeds merged together in 20 years ago. And for over 20, 20 years period, we have added more and more instrument. We haven't removed, uh, or we have removed very few. <laughs> so. And, and we now is the time to challenge uh, the content of the tray, why they are there and what they are used for. Okay, so a typical coronary artery bypass graft tray contains 119 instruments. And uh, one consultant, uh, after the procedure, he found 47 instruments are totally unused. So uh, redundancy rate is 39.4%. We have done it for next uh, four, uh, three other consultants. The number may not be similar. But although uh, the numbers are not similar, at least 25 instruments are same, and we can remove it without delay. Okay, and the weight of the uh, tray with all instruments is 6.4 kilo, and if we remove this unused instrument, it's 1.2 kilo re uh, reduction of the weight. So the weight will come down to 5.2. And uh, we have also count the time, and experienced uh, in scrub nurse can take about three minutes to uh, count all the instrument. And uh, uh, if we remove the unused instrument, the time will come down to one minute. As we all know that they are doing three counts for every procedure, so we can reduce it three minutes. Bear in mind, there are so many new uh, trainees are coming, and it takes longer time to count as well. Okay, so we have spoken the B Brown uh, sterilization team, and they have said that if we remove this amount of instrument, uh, the cost reduction would be three pounds per sterilization cycle. And in uh, Leeds 2012, we have operated 571 coronary artery bypass graft, and we can reduce the uh, um, uh, saving about 1,713. And uh, in whole UK, uh, 2012, 16,791 coronary artery bypass graft was done. The potential saving should be more than 50,000. If we in, uh, apply the same principle uh, to all instrument in Leeds in 2012, we can save more than 3,000 pounds. And if we apply the same principle in every cases in UK, in every unit in UK, we can save up to more than 100,000. All right, uh, this is the uh, calculation from the sterilization group, but we, I haven't mentioned about hidden cost like uh, handling, transportation, uh, uses of this uh, water, and uh, other, uh, other detergent to every step. And uh, as you know, more cluttered tray has caused damage to the instrument more. Another most important factor, more instrument, more counting, and more cause of human error. 
All right, this uh, study is giving us an, uh, just an overview of opportunity to uh, uh, realize the savings in cardiac surgery. Uh, and uh, as we all have done, done in that way for a long time, this uh, attitude should be changed, and it applies to all practices. And the uh, British uh, uh, team, um, cyclist team, and the leader, he said that it's all about marginal gain. Okay, if, that means that if we uh, uh, make a big, a go big goal, we have to make it a small step first, and then at the end of the day, we'll find a huge increase in our reserve. All right, uh, this uh, study will uh, look through in the next uh, next uh, year about the rationalized of cardiac surgery tray, rationalize the number and variety of all disposables, and we'll uh, try to re limit the number of processes. We also try to adopt open only uh, when needed principle, especially for sutures, uh, because at the end of the procedure, how many sutures are opened and not used, that's quite alarming. Thank you very much.